I am currently residing here in Korea. Okay, so I would like to share with you this very amazing and really, really useful product for every woman. Okay, so I would like to share with you my presentation. Okay, please wait for a while. Okay, it's all about our women's vegetable leather sneakers. So the first time I heard about this product, when they said that it will be launched in uh, Korea, I wonder what is vegetable leather because I only know synthetic leather, natural leather, something like that. But now in Atomy, we have this vegetable leather. Then as I come to learn about this PowerPoint presentation, then I have learned that this vegetable leather is one of the high-end, high-quality leather that is used in uh, the high-end product like the famous product and luxurious brand like Louis Vuitton or any high-end products with leather. So let's uh, see and uh, look at the feature one by one of this product. Okay, so uh, the tagline is comfort and stylish women's vegetable leather sneakers. So that is our tagline here in Atomy. Comfort and stylish. It is stylish at the same time. You are comfortable in using this pro these shoes because as we know, some shoes are very stylish, but you are not comfortable to use, right? But there are some also that is really comfortable, but it's not stylish. But in Atomy, we have both comfort plus stylish. So that is the tagline of our women's vegetable leather sneakers. Okay, so why comfort and stylish? So it says here, be bold with light footstep and the, the last lovely point to complete your fashion. So it's uh, you can have your light footstep because of the features of this product that I'm going to discuss later on. So you can uh, use it to complete your fashion because it will match all the clothes, the dress that you will have. And there will be tips at the end where what kind of suit or what kind of dress that are you going to match it with the shoes. Okay, so it used high quality vegetable leather. So these are now the features. It used high quality vegetable leathers. It has outstanding interior material. It is It has non-slip and stable sole and it is light grip very very light so uh, some shoes uh, you are not comfortable because it's really really heavy right but this one you really have the light footstep because these shoes are really heavy or are, are really light okay so what is vegetable sneakers let's uh, learn about these vegetable sneakers so instead of chromium used during the leather processing process, tannin, a vegetable raw material extract, is used to tightly weave the fibers of the leather. So the outer skin of our vegetable women's sneaker is made of vegetable leather. Due to the nature of vegetable leather to be worn later, it may feel hard when first worn. This is also my experience when I... I use it for the first time, I feel hard, but as time goes by that I continuously using these uh, shoes or sneakers, it becomes flexible according to the fit of the ruler. So you will feel comfortable uh, later on as you continue to use this vegetable leather. But for the first time wearing it, it's it, you have a feeling of hardness, but then later on it will be comfortable. So we have the tanning process to remove impurities and to treat the leather so that it does not rot. Depending on the reagent use, it is largely divided into vegetable leather and chrome. And of course, ours in Atomy is the vegetable leather. So let's try to compare the vegetable leather and cr chrome leather. So ours is vegetable leather. It is used, it use of vegetable tannins. The process is long and difficult. It took about two months to make this uh, the tanning process or to make this kind of leather, it took two, it took two months for the manufacturer to uh, get this kind of or to make this vegetable leather. And it has only small volume production. That's why it's a little bit expensive because the production is in small volume. 
and it is more durable than chrome leather and it is often used for high quality leather. As I have told you a while ago, this kind of leather, the vegetable leather is being used with the famous and luxurious brand that uses leather. While the chrome leather, it uses a chromium sulfate salt, not vegetable. And the process is fast and, and convenient. It only took one to two days to produce this kind of leather. It's also called synthetic leather and it has massive production. So that not a small volume, but it has massive production. And would you know that more than 80% of the leather sold in the market is chrome leather. And the 20% of which is of course the high quality leather, vegetable leather and other uh, kind of leathers as well. Next is uh, this, Women's vegetable leather sneakers has comfortable fit, simple design, and lovely look sneakers that match any fashion style. It could be semi-formal, casual, formal, and so on and so forth. You can use it for any kind of fashion that you have. And uh, not only we have the women's vegetable leather sneakers, as I have told you a while ago, we have also men's vegetable leather sneakers, but I am only focusing today about the women's vegetable leather sneakers. So these are the features. Number one, it has simple design. It is a stylish coordination possible in various styles such as casual, formal, etc., daily, and so on and so forth. And it has high quality material. It is made of high end vegetable leather. And aside from that, it has ergonomic triple sole. So, may, so there is an insole, midsole, and outsole that I'm going to discuss later on. And this is what uh, I like about this because, uh, of course, I am short. And these um, women's vegetable leather sneakers provide a comfortable and stable, stable fit with 4.4 centimeter height effect. So the first time I use it, I feel like uh, my height is is being added. So uh, I feel like I am taller than before. That, and as I learned about this, so there is really a 4.4 centimeter height effect inside or in the middle or in the midsole of the leather sneakers. Now in the insole, it provides a comfortable fit and height effect. And then number two, in the midsole, it strengthens the comfortable fit by supporting the adhesion and cushioning of the insole. So we can find, uh, I'm sorry, we can find the 4.4 centimeter height effect on the insole, not on the midsole, that, uh, not on the midsole. And the outsole prevents from slipping and provides a stable fit, excellent abrasion resistance as well. So those are uh, the ergonomic triple sole of this leather sneakers. And it has also light grip. It provides a light fit at 252 grams, 235 millimeter size or one foot standard. So it's really light, it's not heavy. So you can walk even for a long, if you go to a long walk, long travel, and you need to walk um, maybe a lot of um, kilometers, then this one would be the best shoes for you. And it is a domestic product, reliable product made from safe materials and sturdy. Okay, so made with vegetable leather and ergonomic design. So the product name is Women's Vegetable Leather Sneakers. It comes with four colors, white, black, beige, and gray. So the one that I have at home is the white. I choose the white one because it match all the colors the, the kinds of clothes that you have and the colors that you have. But as I look uh, on the shoes, white, black, and beige gray, it also, um, it also matches all the clothes as well. But I love the white because it's now uh, on trend, right? Usually you can see a lot of people wearing white. That's why I get the white one. And the size is from 225 millimeter to 255 um, millimeter. So, the material, the outer material is vegetable leather. The lining is synthetic leather. The window is synthetic resin, the color matching. There is a phyton like uh, design at the back. So you can see here, there is a phyton. A phyton is a kind of snake, right? So there is a phyton design here at the back and which really make stylish 
again because of that design. And the white black is a natural leather, while the beige and gray is a synthetic leather. And then the show laces, it has a glitter point show laces. So it's really feminine because it has also a glitter point show lace. And of course, the manufacturer is made in Korea or Republic of Korea. So as I've told you, we have four colors available. We have white, black, beige, and gray. And as, uh, as long as it was launched in Korea, it, is, it was immediately sold out. And we waited for a while before um, there it was replenished so as long as soon as it was replenished on the website so some of you already bought it right and on the way going to your place to your country so that later on you can you could also enjoy this uh, very very comfortable women's vegetable leather sneakers so this is the details of the white one so as you can see here this is the front side this is the side view this is the one that i am talking a while ago phyton like design at the back which made, made, made it more stylish. And there is actually the glittery uh, shoelace is not that uh, visible. So you can just see the glitters if you look closely at the product. But if you look um, a little bit far from you, you cannot see the glitter effect of the white one. So this is how it looks like in um, detail or in, uh, in a closer look. So that is the white one. And next, we have also the black one. This is the detail. This is the front one. And there is, um, don't worry about those. Uh, sometimes you worry if there is like atomy at the back here. But uh, the good thing is, is there is no uh, sign here like atomy sign, but it is on the insole. You can see here atomy here on the insole, but there is no sign of atomy at the back or on the visible part. It, what, it is under or on the insole. And this is the side view. There is also glittery uh, shoelace, but it's not that visible. And this is the back view. And this is the another side view. So you can see here, there is a 4.4 centimeter height effect. So even if it has a 4.4 centimeter height effect, it's still comfortable to walk. And you cannot feel, you just feel that you, you, you feel like you are taller, but then still really, really light and comfortable. Next, this is the beige one. This beige also is really good and stylish. So this is how it looks like, the details. So here is the phyton uh, like design as well and the insole here color white and it has atomy uh, atomy tag at inside now this is the last one the gray one so this is how it looks like so it depends on you on how uh, on what color do you want but for me i strongly recommend the white one because as i've told you a while ago a lot of people are wearing this white because it match all the kinds of clothes that you have. So that is our gray uh, details. Now, this is the composition and features of our um, women's vegetable leather sneakers. So the exterior is made of premium vegetable leather. The insole, the first, the insole is, uh, provides a comfortable fit and natural high effect height effects so the insole will provide you the 4.4 natural height effect and the midsole for comfortable cushioning that's why some uh, some shoes if you use it for a long a long time already then you can feel the outsole right it it's hard and it's not comfortable because of the outsole but because of the midsole uh, which is made for comfortable cushioning uh, you cannot feel the outsole. So it has also the outsole, which is a stable fit and outsole to prevent from slipping. And also here, there is also uh, the, on the sole part, then uh, there is what we call a spike. So you will not be easily uh, glided or you will not be going to slide because there is a spike at the back of the shoes. Okay, next is stylish and versatile. Anyone can comfortably wear it daily. Even if you are young, you are middle aged, you are old, you can still use this um, comfortable uh, women's sneakers. 
because it's versatile and stylish. So let's try to look some tips on how to use it. The white one, you can match it with uh, just casual jeans to create a lively image. So look at the photo on the right side. So with your uh, classic denim jeans and casual jeans, you can just use your uh, white sneaker. And if you have the budget, maybe you could have all the colors, right? And then match it with a suit set up to complete a comfortable yet sophisticated business look. So if you are going to attend a business meeting, then maybe you could use, of course, a suit. Because if you are going to use a skirt with the black one, it's, uh, it's not that formal or it's not that sophisticated, right? So if you are going to go to a business trip or a business meeting, then you need to uh, set up it with a suit and then the black shoes to make it a sophisticated business look. Next is a graceful look that goes well with a feminine skirt. So if you have this skirt as well, then the beige color will be the perfect one that matches this kind of fashion. Okay, next is you can, if you are sporty, of course, you can also wear the gray one and uh, one mile wear and cross coordinated matching up. You can use like a monotone. So if like, for example, you have, um, you have a training wear, uh, like the color is beige, then you can use the beige one. The color is black, you can use the black one. The color is white, you can use the white one. And if the color of your uh, training uh, wear will be gray, then that would be better if you use also the gray shoes, okay? Or the gray sneakers. Now, this lovely look doesn't miss a single so let's move on to the shoelaces. It is feminine shoelaces because you can create a feminine image by matching shoelace with glitter yarn. So as you can see here, there is a little bit glitters on the yarn. But of course, you can also change the yarn if you want. So if you want it more um, colorful, then you can make an, uh, you can use another kind of yarn or shoelace, then you can mix and match on your sneakers as well. And there is an edge point, which make it stylish again, is the python design. The python pattern match with tone on tone by color. Like for example, uh, the white one, it has a gray and white color of the python design as well. And for the black one, it has gray and black color for the Python. And for the beige one, it has the combination of beige and black pattern of the Python design. And the gray one is combination of black and gray, black and gray um, on the Python design. And now it has premium vegetable leather materials as well. The outer materials is designed utilizing the naturalness of natural full grain leather. The lining provides a comfortable fit with an integrated structure inside the shoe. And um, this one is made of natural leather. So as you can see, natural leather has natural wrinkle found in natural cowhide. So if you can see it personally, it really uh, looked natural because it has some wrinkles. But if the leather is synthetic, it is even, it has an even design. There is no wrinkle, it is an even design as if it is imprinted. But this natural leather or the vegetable leather is more natural because it has wrinkles. So you can see that the leather is natural and not synthetic if there is a wrinkle found on the, uh, on the leather itself. But if it's not moving like it's even and it's like imprinted, then that's, that is a synthetic leather. So that is how we can see if the leather is natural or synthetic. And vegetable leather is processed using animal blood as it is. So there are wrinkles, pores, scars and the like peculiar to leather on the surface of the fabric. And I forgot to tell you that vegetable tanning or the process of making a vegetable leather refers to the leather that is tanned with oak and spruce bark or also quebracho, tarapods, olive leaves, rhubarb roots or mimosa or in other words made of vegetable or trees or barks. And these substances are placed in a pot along with the uh, 
skins and hides as these tannins derive from plants the leather is called vegetable tanned leather that is why it's called vegetable tanned leather tanned leathers because the materials is made from the plants and so that's it how to see if the leather is natural leather or synthetic leather and ours is a natural leather which is made of vegetable leather material okay now what about the inside okay it provides a comfortable fit and height effect on the insole insole made of polyurethane and wet fox leather provides a comfortable fit and provides a hidden height effect of 4.4 centimeter so if we are going to see the polyurethane insole it provides a comfortable fit by evenly distributing the weight of the body and the wet artificial leather or the chamod type this is a luxurious materials that absorb the sweat well and controls the slippage that's why uh, even if you use it and it's a little bit close then uh the the sweat is being controlled as well the sweat is being controlled as you are going to use this so if you have this you you experience a lot of sweating on your foot then if you use this uh, vegetable sneakers then maybe the wetness of your foot will be controlled as well and the atomy logo is neatly engraved so this is how it looks looks like the atomy logo is neatly engraved on the insole so you cannot see it because you can just only see it on the inside and it has also 1.4 centimeter high lead standard reinforces cushioning and distributes body load or the natural height effect so that is what we call the insole what about the midsole so the midsole with cushion and two millimeter eva cushion what do we mean by eva cushion it means ethylene vinyl acetate the structure reliably supports the adhesion of the insole and the cushioning feeling enhancing comfort so because of this midsole you will feel the comfortable cushion feeling it's really soft it's not hard that's why your feet is being relaxed because of the midsole and uh, the comfortable cushion feeling that's the midsole offers okay and last we have the outsole it is manufactured by the phylon old method and provides a comfortable fit it has excellent wear resistance the outsole finished by arians method and this arians method reinforces durability and provides stable grip and because of this arians method as well there is no bruises uh it it uh it prevents the bruises here on the leather and then it has also two transverse row group uh, which make it anti-slip and then the bottom piece it is lightweight only 78 grams based on 225 millimeter for one pair and lightweight sole with soft hardness to help you walk comfortably so it's really comfortable uh, even if i am telling you that it's really comfortable if you are not using it or uh, if you don't have the chance to use it of course you will uh, no, you you don't know what to say right so the first time i we during our young leaders workshop they let us wear these vegetable sneakers and i immediately fall in love so as soon as it was launched i immediately buy uh, both mine and until now i'm really enjoying walking with my sneakers or beige, women's vegetable sneakers and i usually ma match it with my outfit as well so so again these are the colors available the white black beige, gray and uh, the sizes is in millimeters so you can maybe use the tape measure and 225, 230, 235, 240, 245, 250, 255. For US, for 225, I think it's uh, five. And then for 230, it's six. 235, it's seven. 240 is eight. 245 is nine. 250 is 10. And 255 is 11 inches. Uh, yeah, 11 inches. And uh, usually when I use uh this high heels i usually buy the 230 size but then um so because if you have this um big size of high heels then it will be easily removed from your from your 
uh, what they call this, from your uh, feet, right? But uh, if you want to be comfortable, of course, you can get the one, one more than one size. Like for example, I am using the high heels 230. Then when I buy these sneakers, I bought the 235 or the 235 size because I really love to have a comfortable um, a walking shoes or the sneakers. And because if you use the high heels, you don't need to use the socks, right? But here you need to use the socks. That's why it if you are using 225, it's better if you if you use or if you buy the 230. That is another tip from me based on my experience. So that's it for today. Thank you so much for listening. That is all about our women's baseball leather sneakers. If you have any questions, then I am willing to answer. Thank you so much and thank you for your time.